we're just like not going to talk about my hair because it's really annoying me. Um, getting annoyed at your hair is just a different type of sadness. So. Tequila. my channel so for today's video I'm going to be doing kind of like a throwback video because the prime time of when I used to watch YouTube was like 2013 to 2015 so that's when I like loved YouTube and back then they used to do videos like what's in my college bag or like where I take to school with me or like room tour so the video I'm going to be filming today is like a why take with me if I'm going to go like out to study. So whether that be the library or like a little cafe or like a study room that the university has set up for us. Um, I know that's not going to be the case for a long time now, but it was the case back in first semester and I did do that quite a lot back then. So I just wanted to show you guys like what I carried with me and like what I took with me and honestly I'm gonna have so much fun filming this video because I used to love watching these kinds of videos just because I'm a very nosy person so before we start if you do enjoy this video don't forget to hit a huge thumbs up subscribe and let's get started I also remember like before people used to show their bags they used to be like oh my god my bag is so heavy so this is the bag that I use I mean it's actually quite heavy though because there's a lot of stuff in here but this is a black Fiore bag. I believe I got this for my birthday two years ago, I want to say. Friends bought me this two years ago and I absolutely love it. She's my little baby. Um, this is the bag that I use if I'm going like out to study. When I, when I was doing my A-levels, I used to go to the gym a lot to study. So I used to go like do my class and then work there for a couple of hours. But I don't go to the gym anymore. Um, plus the gym in my in my university is like really small. There's like nothing there to study for. But enough rambling. So this is the bag. It's actually kept up such good condition. Like for two years, and I've used this bag non-stop. She's actually like thriving. She's doing pretty well. But anyway, let's just get started. So on this side, I have sunglasses. I don't always have these. Only on when it's like really sunny. Why else would you wear sunglasses? To look cool, I guess. Um, I'm just gonna put this down here for a minute. But I also remember when people used to like put their sunglasses on and like try them on, so. Oh, bitch, I'm a big gangster. I turn around with his foreign love. Um, anyway, so yeah, these are. I don't really. I don't remember where I got these. They're probably from like Primark or something. I honestly don't remember. Okay, so now we're actually like diving into the bag. So there's like a little back pocket over here so i'll go through what's in that first in here oh, oh my god i have my student id which oh my god the lanyard is battered would you look at that and i only got this in like october maybe it was the next yeah in october so i mean she's been through it i need to wash this lanyard i have my uh dorm key dorm key what do you call it like room key i don't really know and then i've got my id um i'm like not gonna show you guys what's on the front of my id for personal reasons but i'll show you the photo who do i think i am anyway we didn't have to get like passport photos for our ids i know a lot of universities do tell you that you're supposed to have like a passport picture for your student id but like ours didn't really say like they were just like as long as it's a photo you're okay with like employers and stuff seeing and then i have three sets of headphones trust me i am prepared so i have like the old iphone not like the old old iphone headphones the old iphone headphones where it was like the what do you call this like um like this this uh jack is that what it's called jack um, and then this is for my laptop if like, my AirPods run out of charge and I do use my AirPods with my laptop more than I use it with my phone. I don't really know why. Um, I just do. Speaking of which, I then have my AirPods, just the regular first generation, first generation, the first ones that ever came out. 
and then I have my really old like new iPhone headphones so they're the ones with the same like jack as the charging port I'm not a techie so I really don't know what the like technical names for those things are so please don't ask me moving on into the actual bag let me give you like a quick overview I remember people used to do that in the old videos. I, I keep saying I remember people used to do that in the old videos. I loved those kinds of videos. They were like my favourite to watch. And I already said that as well. Anyway, so in there, there's the big compartment in the middle and then there's two little like side pockets over here. I guess I'll go through the side pockets first. So in the first one, I have like stationery, I guess, because most of my work that I do now is online. And even if it wasn't like I take all my notes on my laptop anyway, but I like to make my to-do lists on paper, which you guys will have seen. So I have whatever I need for that. So <clears throat> I colour code my to-do lists, uh, depending on what I'm feeling. So today I was uh, feeling green. So today's tea, tea, tea. Um, today's theme is green. And then I just have pencil and a pen because essential. I also have some, uh, oh my god she's like jam-packed in okay i also have some post-it notes because you know it was also really surprising to me how quickly i transitioned from paper to like paper free because back in high school and back at a levels I made all my notes by hand, every single one, some were flashcards, some like mind maps and stuff. Literally every single set of notes that I had for my three subjects were all handmade. And I remember that used to take me so long to do. And like all my notes, obviously I would take by hand or like we would be given our notes. Whereas now, the only time I ever use paper is if I'm trying to work like something out where when it's like mathsy. Or if I'm doing my to-do list or like writing my planner, which is kind of weird. And to be honest, it doesn't really feel that different because I've kind of like adapted to uni life now. Like I'm sort of, I guess I'm like kind of used to working from my laptop. That's another change you guys will see when you're at uni. So, so in the next pocket, I have my phone. This is a case to buy case. I absolutely love this phone case. I got it for my birthday this year. So I haven't had this baby in for too long. It's like almost two weeks now. Um, she's beautiful. She's New York. New York is literally like the top place I want to go. Like it is number one on my bucket list. And I was meant to go last year, but you know, Corona. It's okay, we're not salty about it. Now moving on into the actual compartment. I'm just literally gonna pick things out at random. So I have my wallet, oh, Costa and Starbucks card because coffee addict. Um, I then have a, uh, what do you call this, like a coin purse. This, I bet this only has like two peas and stuff in it. Yeah. Oh, it has some earrings in there. What the hell? There's like a mini little peg in here. Oh my god, no, I do know where that's from. Okay, so if you guys have ever been to Revolution, um, they do bottomless brunch there. And me and a couple of friends had gone there for bottomless brunch. And we remember we got these little like butterfly, these little butterflies on like these pegs on our drinks. And we thought it'd be really cool to keep the butterflies. Um, oh my god, yeah, she's still in here. Oh, she's dead. She, oh, she passed away? Oh. Hmm. All right. Oh my God, circuit laundry. If you're a uni student and you know what circuit laundry is, I am so sorry. Um, lip balm, moisturizer that I'm prescribed because I have eczema, hand sanitizer, very important, especially in these days. I don't, I, I'm gonna be completely honest. I never used to carry around hand sanitizer before coronavirus. My glasses in this, uh, I guess, case, this little perfume thing. What is this? Sea salt and freesia. I don't know where this is from, but this is literally the freshest scent you will ever smell. It smells so good. It smells like the beach, and I really miss the beach, so. I have my... Ow. 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 
I have my little like adapter thing because the new MacBook, the new MacBooks. I don't know if it's just the Airs or the Pros, but they don't have like USB ports anymore. They only have like the charging port type thingies, so we can't use like USB sticks on them. Which is why I got one of these adapter things. I normally have my like phone charger and laptop charger in here as well, but they're currently plugged into my wall because I'm not actually going anywhere. Did I just pack this bag for fun for this video? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. I have my planner. I mean, it, it's a planner. Like, what else? I don't know what you guys really want me to say about that. It has all my like due dates and stuff written in here, like when I have when I have like assignments due. The amount of times I've said I don't know in this video. I then have this notebook, which is like reflective. That's really, really annoying. I'm so sorry. But it's literally just, <laughs> just like a random notebook. Like if I remember something and I want to jot it down. I then have my to-do list. This you guys have seen multiple, multiple times. You guys know I love my to-do list. And then I believe this is the last thing. That's my laptop. Um, this is my baby. If this went missing, I would probably die. Everything is on here. I edit on here. I watch YouTube on here, watch Netflix on here, draw my notes on here. Literally everything is on this laptop and I would probably cry if something happened to it. She's the MacBook Air. I think she's the 2021. Well, baby. I didn't actually set her up until September because I had my school laptop which we gave back in August and then for like two weeks I was like what's the point of me setting up this laptop because I'm really not going to use it so I just used my old laptop which was like by then she was she must have been about six or seven years old she was like an old HP laptop she served me well though she got me through GTSEs which was fine but with that that is the end of this video I really hope you guys enjoyed it I know I did enjoy filming this video I absolutely loved it uh, for the third time today. These are one of my favourite videos to film because I'm a very nosy person and I love to see what other people have in their bags. So if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to smash a huge thumbs up. Comment down below letting me know what other videos you guys want to see. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!